This is for everybody who has ever felt tired in organizing. <laughs> Anyone who's ever felt like gotten that victory, that victory that you worked for for so long, for years and years, that you put all your blood and sweat and tears into, and then you get the victory, and it just seems so small. Um, but we have to remember that every, every small step is a victory. Sometimes just getting up in the morning is a victory. So this is, all, this is for all of you. When the Israeli soldier informs Eman that his living room is now a closed military zone, there is no one to blame. Not the boy soldier, not the paper stuttering in his hand. When Daniel is broken awake by the divine thunder clap of a cop's boot, there is no one to fire, no men to teach, no boys to scold. When we scream against the police chief's windshield, begging him to stop the vans, there are no human eardrums in that car, only job descriptions, metal mouths, dial tones. When the tear gas canister cracks open the earth of Kaya's back, there is no sad bully to love back to good. When my friend loses his job again and again and again, it is not personal. When the school, sorry, I just memorized this. When the school welcomes prison guards into its home rooms, the rule book stays silent. When the mayor turns a blind eye to the sea of whispers washing against his door, it is an odorless gassing, slow drip cotton clogging nostrils all the way to sleep, to fog, a nameless god we can all fear, burning effigy in the town square, synchronized crank and yet never really there, never really there, a faceless virus at whose feet each cog can kneel, hands up, float on the heels of pawns, saying, I have a family too, tell me you wouldn't do the same if you walked a mile in my puppet strings. At such times, at such times, we look up from burning the rule book only to see its pages clouding the eyes of our parents and the enemy evaporates back into the sky, leaving only the birds and each other to shoot, ha uh, to shoot at. At such times, we hunt the only way we know how. When Adib stands, branches outstretched, shouting at the line of deaf soldiers, it is not enough but it is holy. When a brick and bottle reveille rains down on the army jeep, it is not enough, but it is worthy. When Jamila sings a eulogy for the doomed prisoner, it is not enough to save him, but it is sacred. When Ian spray paint extinguishes the billboard lie, it is not enough to stop the tide, but it is a tiny and precious moon. When Sierra first loves her body out loud, it is not a revolution, but it is poetry. When Laura pulls that first howling carrot from the former vacant lot, it is not a revolution revolution, but it is poetry. When the tenant refuses to leave, it is not a revolution, but it is a victory. And when we bang and bang on the windshield, it is not a revolution, but it is human. And flesh our hearts, and flesh our fists breaking on the glass, and true, the histories burning our throats. And because today our hands may not be wide enough to stir the gas tank sympathies of the hollow-eyed gatekeepers of empire, because today our throats may be stripped and scratched from shouting at the emperor hiding in the clouds. Let us never forget to speak to each other down here in the soil where all good things grow. I'm gonna leave it at that.